Welcome back to the channel guys. Today's video we're going to be going through the foundations SBCs, the last two we didn't complete in yesterday's video. On my transfer lift, as we left off on the last video, I managed to sell three items here and I relisted the other cards again, this time at a lower price to see if they do sell. Be patient, they will go eventually. And then with the extra coins I had, I had about 3,000 coins on the account. I went and completed every single one of these SBCs by buying bronze cards. Now, very important that you don't spend more than 150 coins on each of these cards. Even if you're getting outbid, just keep going, find a different player, bid on them. Look for weird nations like Romania and look for players that you had in your club. For example, I had a standard Liege goalkeeper. I went and found a standard Liege center back for 150 coins that met the requirements and made it easy for me to complete this foundations SBC. Again here, I had two players in the club, so I just went and bought three little uh, United States players, and it made it so I could complete foundations four, and I did the exact same thing over here for foundations number five. In total, I spent about 2,500 coins, and we're gonna get ourselves quite a few packs out of this. So for completing every single one out of Foundations 5, you get some gold cards back. A gold pack here, another gold pack here, another gold pack here. This is the most expensive one because you need cams, but try to work with the cards you have in your club. It will bring down the price substantially. And a premium gold pack to finish it all off. And another two rare player pack. This is nice. Let's see if we can get lucky with here now. Silver packs, don't expect much out of these, but we're going to use these cards here to keep filling up the club and completing the next set of SVCs that hopefully can land us a big, big pull. All right, didn't show you guys the silver packs, as I don't think you'd be very interested, but these gold packs, you never know, especially this early on to the game. It All it takes is another little um, player to come in. We had Oshaman last episode. That was a very nice pull. And this time around, hopefully we can add someone else here. A couple little camp styles will definitely be very, very useful. And we get our first duplicate already. Next gold pack. I sent Igor to the SPC storage. Not too sure how that works, but hopefully I can just go and use him for a couple more SPCs we have to complete here. And look at that, a bunch of prem players with off nations. This is all really good stuff to help us complete the next foundation set. Next gold pack, come on EA. One decent pull out of these. Mateus, okay, Brazilian, off league. Um, that's what I'm looking for here. I'm looking for these obscure players. Indeed, he's good for these SPCs as well. And a thousand coins. That's going to help us out a lot. Very nice. Premium gold pack. Come on now. Best one out of the lot. Mm, Ricardo Arta, 81 rated. Oh, Anton as well. I mean, not good enough, but it's another gold rare. We will take those as they will be needed. We get our first hunter. That is very, very nice. And another manager that will just add to the club. So far, so good. Let me keep that sentinel as well. All right, we got two rare gold packs. Let's see. Let's see here. Come on, EA. First one, not very good. Not at all. Medina, another decent guard for SPCs though. Last one out of the bunch. 1,600 coins to work with and... A Pacheco. I mean, our luck isn't in right now, but we're going to do what we can with what we have. I've been busy doing the bronze pack method. Of course, all of these players we had tradable in the club. I decided to sell them and invest in the bronze pack method. I made about 10,000 coins. And with those coins, I went and completed hybrid nations. Boys, I am so excited to see what we can get out of these. Hybrid nation was a pretty easy one to complete. For this one, I had every single player in the club and I just made it work. You guys can do it too. Play around with the packs, the players you get, and eventually you'll get the solution that works for the required SPC. Sixth of the best as well was every single player in the club, which is always nice. We're trading more players for more players and the hope to getting something nice. For this club here, boys, make sure you're patient. Bid on all the players. You will get the majority of them for 350 coins and the gold you can get them for 600 coins. Just be patient. There is no rush, especially if you're waiting for midnight to get on the game. And the last one, Around the World, took some little bit more time and my player's gone now. Like I said, bid on the players, 300 coins. It's that simple. Let's get back here to Hybrid Nations and Adam. He must have been part of both solutions. And there you have it. 
a 50k pack for the fourth set of the SBC and a rare mega pack for completing it all. I am excited. Also, EA have removed bronze packs from the store. It makes no sense. Let's see our daily little preview here. Come on now. Oh, Ricardo Pereira, 78. That's two days in a row where we'll not be trying to buy that. Okay, here we go. A prime gold players pack. No minimum guarantee on this. And we're going to get, oh, an 82 Salvai. Honestly, looking at her, and I see a couple more SBCs getting completed here. Uh, let's store all these in the club. Electron players pack. Some of these aren't too good, but you never know. Mm, Mark Gahey, 81. Decent card. I mean, he might play a couple games for the club here. A couple more silver to help us do a couple more SBCs as well. All right, three big ones here. First one, prime gold players pack. 82 plus on this. Oh, it's going to give me an 82 Brozovic. An 82 Paqueta as well. Alurma. Frank Garcia. Decent little card there. Jala. He's got some pace on him. Okay. It's an okay pack. But not what we want. Rare Mega Pack next. Come on EA. Here we go. Come on now. 83 plus on here. Oh. Obedorf. Our first. I guess our second walkout of the channel here. Martinez in there as well. Ugarte. Ito. Decent card. Pina. Kalulu. Oh, look at Abdullah. Nice, nice, nice. Not too bad. We got a shadow in there as well. I like it. That was a decent one, boys. That was a very decent one. The big boy pack. It's a 50k pack here. 83 rated or more. Come on, EA. Uh, was it worth the grind? Mm, 84 Baltimore and Ortega in there. ZH, Arsenis, Bowie. Madison's okay. Oh, could have been a lot better. St. Juiced. I mean, we're picking up some pacey players here. Let's see what I can put together. Okay then, so here you have it, the team at the end of today's video. We've made a couple upgrades, especially in the fence. Mafora is a mostly gold team, but this team right here, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do much with it. Most likely just take it into squad battles when I do get my hands on the game. For right now, I'm waiting for EA to re-release the classic pack so I can keep doing the bronze pack method to up my coins again. Because with 500 coins, it's going to be very, very difficult for me to complete the last couple SPCs. But I'll do my best. I'll see what I can do. Hopefully some of these guys sell. And there you have it, guys. Let me know if you're excited for the game to drop. Leave a like on the video if you enjoy it. And I'll catch you guys on the next one.